Jesus coming out <laughs> to my backyard. <laughs> so tonight we're celebrating my favorite holiday in the whole year, 4th of July. I like it because it combines two of my favorite holidays, two of my favorite things, fireworks and alcohol. <laughs> tonight most of us are camping. Yeah, camp let me tell you something about camping. I hate it. <laughs> it makes no sense. Hey, you want to go camping? Uh, no thank you. What if I told you you get to poop standing up in the woods? I uh, still don't want to go. What if I told you you get to wake up cold and with a rash? Okay, I'll go. My mom, she always says, Camping used to be a tradition in my family. Well, it used to be a tradition in everyone's family before they invented the house. <laughs> well, and then my dad, he always says, Son, it's really nice outside. You should go outside. Well, Dad, if it's really nice outside, then why are all the bugs trying to get into our house? <laughs> So, some places you have to pay to camp, like here. If you're gonna camp here tonight, $50, cash only, give the money to me. So, some places you have to pay to camp. You have to pay to sleep outside. That must be really insulting to the homeless people. <laughs> and then, some, place, some campsites, you might see a Winnebago. And that's when you realize, Oh yeah, that's what I forgot. My house. <laughs> Happy camper! It's funny, because whenever we use that term, we're being sarcastic. He is not a happy camper. Why can't we just call him a camper? <laughs> the only real happy camper is the guy leaving the campsite. He gets to take a shower. <laughs> Like, it's nice, you get to relax, swim, fish, barbecue, but, but at night you're like, There's monsters out there! I see their eyes! <laughs> and we practic practically um, pre-wrap ourselves for the serial killers. We sleep in bags. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get away, can you? I mean, I can hop for a little, but I'm dead meat. <laughs> and it's the worst when you have to go to the bathroom in the middle of the night, and you say to your friends, Hey guys, you want to come get killed with me or get killed looking for me? <laughs> and it's not just serial, serial killers, it's bears too. So I went camping once, and they gave us this pamphlet. It said, if you ever see a bear, play dead. Now think about it. Think about that. Who wrote that? Who came up with that? Probably the bears. <laughs> Play dead. Cover yourself in honey. Climb on a large white plate. And don't try to run away from us. I mean, the bears. It's like the bears have some ethical code. I don't mess with dead bodies. I'm a bear, not an animal. <laughs> I don't, I don't even understand why we camp with wild animals. There's no other activity that involves wild animals. It's a beautiful golf course, plus on the ninth hole there's a pack of wild wolves. If they start charging towards you, just play through. <laughs> and before, before I leave, I just want to tell the kids, don't be afraid of monsters tonight. There will be no monsters that will hurt you but they will kill your parents. <laughs> and don't be afraid of that bear over there. He's just, he's just a prop. <laughs> he's, he's, he's a decoration, like, like the treadmill in my parents' bedroom. 